Earlier this month in China, thousands of villages in southeastern Fujian province protested against local officials who were selling farmers' land. Now the villagers say they fear retaliation by officials. Here's more. Villagers in China's southeastern Fujian province are living in fear after their land was sold by communist officials. Earlier this month, thousands of residents from Zhujiang village gathered in front of the local Chinese Communist Party committee. They were protesting against local officials selling the land of farmers to developers and pocketing the profits. Farmers say they had no idea their land had been sold until officials brought in earth movers and started destroying their crops. One villager says when they tried to protest, military police retaliated on the crowd. The villagers weren't given the money. The village, county and city officials took villagers' land by force. There's a lot going on, not just this incident. They only gave us a tiny bit of compensation. When the villagers disagreed, the village officials brought in military police. Then a fight broke out. Eight people were hurt. The villagers then protested against this. In the end, everyone went to the protest, about 4,000 people. Three days after the protest, officials began arresting the villagers. On December 16th, officials secretly came at 3 or 4 o'clock in the morning to arrest people. They continued the arrest in the morning. Even 17 and 1-year-old kids were taken. The villagers are now scared to show their faces and they're scared of being beaten. Local media has not reported on the incident. Villagers desperate for help post the news online, hoping to draw attention to their plight.